Genetic modification of food is not new. For centuries, food crops and animals have been altered through selective breeding. While genes can be transferred during selective breeding, the scope for exchanging genetic material is much wider using genetic engineering. In theory, genetic engineering allows genetic material to be transferred between any organism, including between plants and animals. For example, the gene from a fish that lives in very cold seas has been inserted into a strawberry, allowing the fruit to be frost tolerant. By far the most common genetically modified organisms are crop plants. But the technology has now been applied to almost all forms of life, from pets that glow under UV light to bacteria which form HIV-blocking living condoms, and from pigs bearing spinach genes to goats that produce spider silk. The plasmid is removed from the bacterium and the tDNA is cut by a restriction enzyme. Then foreign DNA is cut by the same enzyme. The foreign DNA is inserted into the tDNA of the plasmid. The plasmid is then reinserted into a bacterium. The bacterium is used to insert the tDNA carrying the foreign gene into the chromosome of a plant cell. The plant cells are grown in the culture and a plant is generated from a cell clone. All of its cells carry the foreign gene and may express it as a new trait. It is virtually impossible to provide a complete list of genetically modified foods in the U.S. because there are many laws for genetically modified crops. Honey can be produced from genetically modified crops. Some honey comes from bees collecting nectar from genetically modified canola plants. Rice is genetically modified to contain high amounts of vitamin A. Soybeans genetically modified to be resistant to herbicides. Soy foods include soy beverages, tofu, soy oil, and soy flour. Other products may include breads, pastries, snack foods, baked products, and fried products. Sugar cane is also genetically modified to be resistant to her herbicides. Tomatoes are modified for longer shelf life and to prevent a substance that causes tomatoes to rot and degrade. Corn is genetically modified for resistance to certain pesticides and is used to make corn oil, flour, sugar, or syrup, which I have found in many snack foods, baked goods, fried foods, and soft drinks. Sweet corn is genetically modified to produce its own insecticides. Genetically modified papaya that were resistant to viruses were first commercially grown in Hawaii in 1999. Meat and dairy products usually come from animals that have eaten genetically modified food feed. About 22% of cows in the U.S. are injected with genetically modified bovine growth hormone. For your convenience, there's a restroom located in the rear of the coach.